Nothing says Florida like surf, sun and sand. But this exchange student from Thailand got a lot more than she bargained for. Suddenly, I heard a guy said, there's, there's a shark in the water. A great white shark approached her group of snorkelers Saturday near Isla Morada. Her host parents from Boca Raton were the first to spot it and grab their camera. I come up to the side of the boat and I didn't want to yell because I didn't want all the kids to get freaked out. I said, um, there's a big shark. And he says, yeah, 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 we have sharks. I said, no, 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 a big shark. Christine Posniak says everyone got out of the water, but she says they didn't panic. To her, the shark looked like a submarine. Yeah, he was so big, like really big. We talked to the experts at FAU. Dr. Stephen Kajura says white sharks spend winters in the Keys, but he says it's rare to see one in the water this shallow, even more unusual for it to hang around as long as 30 minutes. Mesmerized, the snorkelers watch the shark circle their boat. Now Mock is sharing this once-in-a-lifetime experience with all her friends in Thailand. They're so spry -like about that, like they're so shocked about that. Even with that newfound respect for what's out in the ocean, this family says it's not keeping them out of the water. They actually went snorkeling just about 30 minutes after the shark left. In Boca Raton, Charlie Keegan, WPTV News Channel 5.